Good evening once again, y'all. I have come back on the whole ghost started moving in my spirit. Um, y'all, I've been doing spiritual warfare. I gotta get my color right now. See, I look I'm looking like looking like I've been fighting. Anyway, like I said, um, we're living in a time, season, time of uncertainty, and uh, you guys, um, God desires because He says. Um, and Jeremiah, so I know the plans that I have for you, and it's to give us a hope and an expected meaning in the future. But right now in this season, you guys, we're dealing with an, an orchestrated rebellion, spiritual wickedness in high place, spiritual war. And it has summoned because of the bitterness and hatred and greed to um, have power. I'm at the break. Well, y'all believe it, what I say. Y'all know Ephesians 6 and the principality, spiritual wickedness, and power. This is what we're dealing with. But right now, what has summoned us is a rebellious spiritual wickedness in high place has birthed this sickness into the natural across our land. Because if you look across the nation, and not all of them, some are just led astray. You got houses, congregations that is joining together. Idolatry worshipers. You guys, we're living in a season of time where he is calling some people back to him in repentance. Um to follow him and his word and to lay down some things. And then he can begin to give you revelation of the next level of what's to come here on earth. Mm. You guys, guys, God is saying we are our own worst enemy. We have the power and the ability to shift by faith this thing. It goes on as long as we allow it to go on. Because God says, the works that I do, you should do, and greater works than that, you should, you should do, because he is going to the Father. And <laughs> the thing, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth, it is in heaven. We have, his kingdom has come here on earth. His kingdom is dwelling among us, just like Satan, because he had power and dominion over the land. In this, in this battle, and we have angelic beings, oh, in the name of Jesus, we have angelic beings that is born right now on our behalf. A death spirit is going sweeping across the land. Mm. My God, God is moving because I didn't come on to say all that, but I, what I, I, God had laid on my heart to come on and say, in this hour, time, you guys, we are our own worst enemy. And he is wanting to abolish this idolatry worship. He is not. He is wanting his people to stop seeking man's face and seek his face. Yes, we're supposed to have leaders, Lord said leadership over us too. But I was taught to undergird us, not to be a God, but to act as a representation as God. Hallelujah. With that being said. I hope that um, you guys begin to hear the word of God. Not highly, because highly, I do not have no heaven or hell to put uh, you in. I just wanted to birth and be a willing vessel of God, because we as a nation, as a whole, we're all going through this together. And um, and united together as one. He said, because where there's uh, one or more in my name, I am in the midst, and I just put out there what God is putting on my heart, so the other believers can get it and and go into spirit and, and begin to intercede and go into warfare on not on behalf of ourselves, but as as a this nation as a whole, because we all got to live here, we all got to dwell here, but we have got to begin to break away from these idolatry worshipers and begin to rebuke these spiritual wickedness that is in high places. With that being said, you guys have a great night, and I'm going to try to rest up and read a little bit more, and I will maybe post tomorrow. I don't know. Just whatever God tells me to do. Have a great night.